Mickey, great victory today uh, and a strong performance. Um, how are you feeling after today's win? Obviously, good response to last week. Uh, again, we've made a couple of little changes. Gone back to the, the back through with Macker in there. He was fit and that. Um, it was good to see him back. He was solid. Um, commanded his area, organised and around them. And the people, the lads in front of him, done, done really well. You know, particularly mentioned the Jordan today. He's, he's worked his socks off against three tough opponents, and he's made he, he's made it difficult for them. And he's brought other players in. Um, Lipper was sharp. Obviously, Kemp he scored a fantastic goal. Um, but having him back again, um, Fergie was excellent again. So all in all, you know, good away performance. Just probably a little blemish was the goal that they've scored. You know, the lads are arguing in there saying it was offside. Um, I sort of go off Fergie's reaction because Fergie's usually quite calm and composed, and the way he reacted to the linesman and the referee it tells me it was offside. But you know, we've had them for us, we've had them against us, so he sort of evened himself out. Yeah, and I suppose even better this week, you know, after the challenges we've had during the week, um, sharing this win with over 350 City fans in full voice today. Yeah, you know, they've responded, the lads have. Um, They've rallied round each other, you know. They've um, they look after each other in there, you know. There's some big characters in there, and, and, and they've responded well. They they want to prove, you know. They, they don't need to prove to us what they're capable of. So, you know, it, it, I think they've um, responded pretty well. You know, the lads go out there and they try the best. You know, every home game, every away game. You know, you, they don't need that sort of criticism or aggression towards them. You know leave that to us, you know, to sort out in the change room. Um, but no, they've responded really well. Um, the fans were fantastic, like you said, um, and fine vice, and you know, they, they were backing us today. Yeah, and two free kicks from Sean Newton. Um, quite a threat he poses from dead balls. Yeah, he kept him at a decent save as well, if, um, in between his two goals uh, from free kick. Yeah, he's under severely conditions, he strikes the ball, dead ball really well. Um, he's a threat and he, he's you know he, he does practice and we see him after training he'll, he'll take a bag of balls he'll take a few balls and he'll he'll work on his technique and you know he's you know, really pleased with him. Yeah and uh, Adam Buxton starting a full game today um, do you fancy him as a holding midfielder? I think he's a good footballer you know you can probably slot him in at, at Swaybury he can play right side centre half right wing back right back so uh, I think he's an intelligent footballer he, he, he um, fill a, a number of positions I just felt we felt today sit in front of the back three and allow the front two and the attacking midfielders and the wing backs to be the threat you know and uh, we thought it worked really well today. Yeah and um, still top of the league um, I guess that puts the pressure on at the top still. We, we, we can only beat what's put in front of us we can only look after ourselves you know make sure we prepare, uh, prepare properly and um, do our homework on the opposition and, and go out and try and perform results that we want that we need you know and I think today we needed that you know you can see see the change room in there you know they're, they're quite pleased and that, you know we, we need to carry that on now you know there's no point in you know winning today and not performing Saturday you know we need to carry that on